Okay, there's a couple of ways. Uh, well, first, I want to start off by showing you uh, this is what I have in my account right now, uh, or my UPX uh, tokens is $861.05, and then uh, $53 I've earned over time. Uh, over the last, I believe it's... Uh, six hours but this is the first way you can become a millionaire this is number one so as you can see uh get upx to become a millionaire you can actually purchase your status as a millionaire and it will cost you roughly a thousand dollars now this means that you get a million UPX coins. Now, if you, I'm gonna close this out. So that means uh, that when you open up my profile, I roughly have purchased about $462 worth of coins, uh, UPX tokens. And I have 86 properties and seven collections. Now here's my discovery. I'm gonna go to some, hopefully there'll be this guy right here. If you look at it, it didn't make sense to me. He's a director. Uh, I believe I'm a director. It doesn't, it's unbelievable that he would have purchased about what I purchased in UPX tokens, or that would be about $4,691. It just seems unreal to me. So I, that's where I kind of made the connection of how people accumulate this net worth. So I'm going to show you. Um, close this guy out and I believe I'm going to open this profile up well this guy has 23 uh, million dollars in tokens and he has 1,305 properties 21 collections now is it possible that he purchased $23,000 I don't know um, this is one of the top guys, but I don't think so. So that led me to this. So you see right here, I have $861.53. So I'm going to stop this now and I'm going to purchase another $100,000 in coins to make my point. Okay. Now that we're back, you can see that I purchased um, about 100,000 UPX tokens. My value now is $100,861.05. So I went up by 100,000. I still have $53.03 in UPX um, interest. So here's what I discovered. So let's go down to the uh, collections. How you, you, rather than purchase, the second way is to get these properties uh, or to get these collections. So as you can see, uh, these are the collections I've, I have so far. And I was able to collect uh, once I got that. So now... I am going to try to go ahead and collect Pacific Heights. Now, the I need four of these properties in Pacific Heights. So the first thing I got to do is I got to find out where Pacific Heights is. So I'm um, going to close this out. And I'm going to scroll in. I believe Pacific Heights is somewhere on the... This would be the east, I, 
go east or west side. Now, to get everything, I got to push or click this button right here to divide things out so I can get the names. And I'm looking for Pacific Heights. The only thing I can do to, to uh, do this faster is go to my web browser and open up a new tab and put in um, or look into Google. Uh-oh. Stop, stop. To uh, Google to look up Pacific Heights. And I go to here and I click in, and there it is over here. Um, it is somewhere next to the main post. This North Beach. Uh, this might be, yes, on the other side. So right here, uh, where this big park is, uh, I don't even know what the Presidio, Presidio San Fran, of San Francisco. So let's go over here. That's where uh, Pacific Heights is. So I'm going to go ahead and close this out. Now, I'm going to zoom out here. Move over here. There's that park. There's Pacific Heights right here so now we got to purchase four properties so the first thing I don't I'm looking I don't have any properties over here so the other thing you got to figure out I gotta move my uh, my explore over there so let's figure out what people are charging to to move so to send over the, to that property it's gonna cost me a hundred he's charging too much I think not going to pay 100 uh, UPX to travel over there. So let's see what he's charging. He's charging 40. All right, I'll give up 40. Let's go. Confirm it. And then my Explorer. Is going to move over there. All right, let's move our property over there. Scroll in. Now, the second way is to get what is being paid. So let's look at the prices of some of these properties. That's 36000 It's 23000 26 19. All right, I'm going to go ahead and purchase one for 19. There you go. Now I got to get 40, so I've got to find the prices for 19 or under. All right. So, and I'm going to let my explorer. Uh, just move around a bit, see if I can find some cheaper prices under 20000 So I'm going to pause the video and come back after I purchased three more properties. Okay, I've uh, purchased four properties. And roughly, I spent about, I want to say, oh, $72,000 maybe? to get those properties, 72,000 in UPX coins. So now let's go over um, to my menu and we'll go to collections. And that was the Pacific Heights. I'll click edit collections. Now, before I do that, I just wanna go back. Um, this is what I'm gonna collect, 3,100. So <clears throat> what people do is they go through this collection. Now, 3,000 uh, UPX tokens is roughly about, uh, if you look at, if it cost me 100,000, it's multiplied by 1,000. So I'm going to say 31 cents 
in US dollars, I think that's my math is about right. So you take off three, one, two, three, we'll do the math later. Uh, but I'm going to click on edit. And then these are the four properties that I purchased. So I have to put these up here. So I got to tap, 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 click done. I collected it. And there you go. I get 3,100 UPX and I got to collect it. Here it comes down here. Now look up here at the UPX, uh, my, uh, my balance. If I collect, the coins are going to go up here and add it to my account. And they're changed. Now I have 31,000. Now, uh, I don't think I have enough. So, the other way, I'm going to close this out. The other way, now I'm going to go back to uh, where I purchased my properties at, and I'm going to show you. So I got two properties over here that I think I paid roughly, um, oh, I can't remember what I paid for those. They were, un they were I think, fifteen to 16000 Yeah, 16560 So now... You see my UPX? I can change that and set it to like that outrageous price the other guy was charging to let's say a hundred. So if somebody wants to um, go on that property to visit, they gotta pay me a hundred PX. And I believe that is another way you generate these uh, people are generating, uh, other players are generating this, all this wealth. So I'm going to set the fee for that property. Now, I have another property right next to it. And I think it's this one, the one above it. So I paid 15800 Now, this is 40 Now, I... One of, one of the things that I, you know, I can do is I can set this, uh, let's say I don't want to charge 80, but let's say I want to charge 70. Now, I could set the fee for all my properties uh, at 70, but the market is going for about 40, so I'm going to set all my fees for about 40, and that sets all of my properties to receive 40 UPX tokens if they want to travel to that neighborhood. So, um, so that's the second way you can become a millionaire is by collect collecting uh, the, the UPX tokens for visiting on the property. Now, the other thing, I got 31,000. Here's the third way I want to show you how people are uh, doing it. Now, I got some property. I'm going to my property. I have some property on Mission uh, Mission Avenue. Now, look at this. It looks like I'm uh, earning. I'm going to go to this property here. So I get to travel for free because it's my property. Now, look at what I have. I have 31,000 left. Now, this is Mission Street. <clears throat> now, I'm going to scroll down here. <clears throat> and this is the other thing that I, the other way you can become a millionaire by trading property. Now, I'm going to zoom in to Mission Street. And this is like the very beginning of Mission Street, I believe, because it cuts off here. But let's travel this street, and what I noticed is everyone has property on Mission Street, right? It's all occupied. It's all taken. I was trying to, to, to uh, collect all these, and I noticed that all these properties were taken as I travel up Mission Street. 
So players that started early have a monopoly on Mission Street. Now, to collect those things, now here's the other thing that I could do. If I want to own some property on Mission Street, this guy's charging 65, I mean, he wants 60, so the ones in green are the ones that are for sale. Now, look at the prices. This guy's charging, wants 35000 this guy wants 168000 Now, some, this is how people are accumulating all this wealth. They're buying the properties cheap, and then they're, uh, because they have a monopoly, and to get that, to get that, uh, all the, the, uh, the, what's the thing I'm looking for, uh, the collections, you have to, you have to, uh, you have to purchase somebody's property because all the property is taken. So let's see if I, I got thirty-one thousand left. Let's see if I can find some property for the amount of money that I have left. It might be very difficult. This guy wants one hundred eighty-eight thousand. So I'm going to move up further, and maybe somebody's asking for a reasonable. Price and this is this is how I figured out the the millionaire thing is that um, yeah I'm not paying that so the other guy the, uh, no I think it was thirty nine thousand so I got to find somebody that I can buy their property for what I have in there or I'm going to be paying up the the nose for um to try to get that collection. Now, I already have the collection, but I wanted to show I can add to my collection, right? If I can find some property for that price. Now, I might have to buy that, that other property, and every, not everybody sell it. That's the other thing. That's what makes it so great. This guy wants 43000 The other guy wants thirty. So let's keep on going on Mission Street. Let's find... We can find somebody that's reasonable, I think. And so uh, I think that's, so this is the third strategy. And I still haven't found anything that's even remotely, I might have to buy that, I don't even know if I have 30000 or whatever that guy was asking for. So I had to keep on going down Mission Street to find if I, see if I can find somebody that's reasonably uh, looking, but you know, here's Tobias. He, I guess, he's a millionaire. I don't know. We'll look at we'll look at his net worth. Now, let's see. Oh, he's not selling property. You got to click on the green one for those that are selling it. Thirty-five thousand. You know what? I'm going to spend another uh, five dollars to be able to buy that property so i'm going to go ahead and stop the video and get five because i want that property for thirty-five thousand. i think that's a great deal my purchase of uh five thousand more i'm gonna go ahead and click refresh to see if they added to my account yet and we got the juneteenth and it was added so this is a game. This is why I bought that property. So in one hour, Upland would hold an in-game event for the sole purpose of solidarity, demonstrating shared values. We ha are having an in-game march on June 10th. Invite all your friends to participate. Visitors account march on top here. You can march on top. Select the selection. For details, and I think the details is that now I got to go back to um, where's my explorer? I got to find that property. Oh, it's up here over here somewhere. I got to find that property for 35000 So, where's Mission Street? Okay, this is Mission Street. Here we go. So along this way, I got to find this property again for thirty-five thousand. See if it's this one. Nope, not that one. Keep moving up. 
think it was maybe this one. Nope. Was it this one? Nope. Was it that one? Nope. Tobias. He's, I don't know, maybe the guy's a millionaire. And maybe people are paying $176,000 for property and not buying that one. I wish I had remembered the address. I just have to find it. See? This guy has a monopoly on this street. Flow. I think I was getting, I'm getting close. I think I'm getting close. Tobias. Yep. See, he's, that's his strategy. That's his strategy. So let's find this. There it is. Okay. I've got enough. I'm going to go ahead and purchase it. Uh-oh. I don't want, yeah, I want to buy it. I've got enough. 35,000. Oh, 36,000. I am short. Look at that. I am short by, I can't believe it. Let me see how many tokens I got. I'm short. Can you believe that? I'm short. Oh, my goodness. I can't even buy it right now. All right, let's see if we find some more. I can't believe I'm short by that many tokens, but that's the way it is. Um, here, let, let's see. Let's see by my coins. If I collect my earnings, I can buy that again. Let's see if I have enough. I might be short still. Let me go back. Where's let me go back. Where's Mission Street at? Okay. What is this one I want? Oh! I found one for less than that. So I'm gonna go ahead and buy it. Was that on Mission Street? Or did I just make a mistake? Yes, it's on Mission Street. Okay, so um, the securing ownership, it's on Mission Street, and I'm going to change my uh, UPX uh, to, actually, I'm going to change it to 40. Now, the reason why I'm changing it to 20 is because they have that event that I showed you, and everybody needs to be on this needs to put their explorer on this block so i am going to set my fee for 20 so people can come to there and i can collect 20 upx uh tokens for visiting my property so i'm going to set 20 for that property and hopefully supply and demand will get me uh a lot of visitors to my price so it, i think it was in about an hour it said so anyway um that is the third way that you can create um buy on mission street and just raise your price um like these other guys are doing i i've seen properties for a million dollars maybe people have paid it but that is another strategy all right thanks for watching okay and this is the last way I want to show you how to become a millionaire. Uh, I want to show you how many properties I have now. I actually uh, am now worth 663315 I'm not a director yet. I'm a pro. But once I reach a million, I will be a director. Now, I have 102 properties and I have eight collections, and this is what my property value is worth so uh, today is uh, June the 19th and I am going to close out of this and come back in about a week look at how much I have in UPX $46.50 I have nothing in I have accumulated nothing right now as far as um, uh, interest and that is the other way that you become a millionaire. So out of those uh, 102 properties, I'm collecting interest and I'm also collecting payments when people uh, stop on my property. So be sure to subscribe and 
uh, I'll to get the update of how much I earn in one week's time without purchasing any more and just staying away from the game. So be sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell to get the notification. Thanks for watching.